My name is Candy Robinson, and I am the North America Sales Leader for Connected Operations within the IoT group. I work with the Maximo and Tririga customers and bring them the IoT story. So it is, uh, I run sales, our direct sellers, and our business development team. We have been talking about asset and facility management for 20 years, I have personally. And it's taking those customers into how do you take the data that are coming from your equipment, your assets, your, an asset can be an individual, it can be your brand, or it can be a physical asset like your infrastructure. And the data that we are creating today and taking that and making a meaningful shift in your business. In the enterprise and, and um, facility asset management space, um, it's hard to change sometimes that process. It can be slow moving, but the way we are rapidly changing and the growth of big data today, how do you meaningfully take that data and impact your go-to-market? So what's your strategy going to be in the transportation industry, in the manufacturing, in the industrial, um, in the facility space? So I was just talking to, um, can I... Skanska, um, who are here, and where are they building buildings in the seaport in Boston? How are they using sensor data to impact that? So where are they um, bringing that sensor data into Maximo? Because that that is an asset, right? So um, that's where we're making, we're changing business. Um, and even within the last year, we have accelerated that conversation. I think everybody's now willing to hear it's okay to move to the cloud. Where are you saving money in that infrastructure? And then where are you also able to combine data sets on a platform and get insight into your business? It went from a traditional asset maintenance um, and facility maintenance conversation where it's you know space planning or capital projects or lease admin or how do you manage a physical asset in a run to fail scenario versus now where you're going you have the capability to take the information coming from those systems to do predictive and long term through those insights I see this as being um, the next step in Businesses being able to, it's its the, you know, what we've been hearing today, it's the autonomous car. So you're not building a vehicle that comes off the line and you lose insight to that end user. You're now driving your business all the way through to the service of that equipment. And where do we um, impact everything culturally, environmentally, um, the, the big data and how we internalize that in this space is going to revolutionize, I think, where we are from an, an enterprise and facility um, asset management space. I see the opportunity being um, how we are go-to-market, where we service the, um, the, that end user. And it's not just the piece of equipment anymore, it's the relationship we have with the business to customer um, as, as, as being critical, I think, as somebody who travels four out of five days a week, take the transportation industry and where um, Delta can tell me where my bag is. They can tell me that uh, what flight I'm on, my connection has changed, the weather patterns, and you know, that in, in every industry, there's some story like that.